What's up guys, it's Ryan Creates. Today, this video is gonna be a bit more on speculation. However, there's gonna be a lot of discussion that's gonna be going on with this topic. And we're gonna be talking about the profile here, but not just anything in the profile. We're talking about this right here. This greed, zeal, mania, and vice graph thingy. So that's what this video is gonna be about. I'm gonna try my best to explain this. There is, even to this day, I've asked pretty much everyone, Discord, um, Reddit, any my friends, anyone else that plays near incarnation, I've been trying to figure out what all this stuff is. So I'm gonna give you what my research has shown. So keep in mind again, this isn't a hundred percent confirmed. This is just what the my the majority of the public opinion is saying. So let's get into this. So you guys can notice right here, I have pretty much everything for me is going towards my greed. And greed has been thought to be spending, not necessarily spending money in microtransactions in the game, but just like doing the mo a lot of roles, and by roles I mean summons, pulls, and spending a lot of gold and getting a lot of gold in the game. So it's believed that if you've been doing that, your greed's gonna go up again. I don't see any proof. I have done quite a few summon pulls lately, and I have spent quite a bit of gold upgrading, but I don't know if that's really the gist of it. Then we have zeal. Now zeal is interesting because zeal usually means great energy, I've heard. And what zeal probably is linked to is zeal might be if you have a lot of stamina, you have a lot of stamina recoveries, and um, you might, maybe you even play a lot, you do a lot of games. Again, like I said before, don't take my word for this. I personally believe zeal might be if you don't barely play the game, maybe zeal will fill up. I have indeed seen one person have a full, all four, I don't know how he did, he said he didn't re-roll, I'm gonna put it up on screen right now, it's fucking insane. I don't know how he was able to get all of them maxed out, but he, he said he just played the game and it just happened, so maybe this really is just all luck and everyone's different. But then we have Mania, which I guess is like Maniac, sort of. Mania is a bit interesting, because I think Mania has to do with battles, I'm not a thousand percent sure. Actually, let me check, let me go into my notes. The game alive, and up and running, but yeah, let me know if you're a whale and you've been having a lot of greed. Honestly, greed's weird. I don't know if it like, gets wider and fills up more to top space if you have more greed or not, but let me know in comment sections below. Again, zeal's probably towards stamina. Maybe you've been playing a lot, maybe you haven't been playing that much. Probably something like that. Mania is interesting because Mania, okay, so I'm not a thousand percent sure of this, but Vice might be like for Vicious or Grimard Vice, I'm not too sure, but Vice might be towards battle, how much you battle like an arena. I'm, there's again, there's no way to confirm this. I'm going to say that a lot in this video, but of pure speculation, I think Vice probably is arena because I haven't played that much of arena lately. So Vice might be tied to maybe arena or actually, you know, let me check right here. Because a lot of people, I do hear people saying that zeal might actually be towards leveling up and that could be possible again, but I, and I'm going to get to what my honest thoughts are in the comments, like, not comments like below. Yeah, sure. In the end of the video. So let's actually move on. So Vice. I'm pretty, I'm not pretty sure, but I would think that because I think vice means like vicious, it might mean vice is somewhere combat oriented. Maybe if you've leveled up a lot of your weapons, a lot of your characters, and that might actually go for mania too. Like mania could easily be like having high character stats, but probably based on what I have and do know, I don't really wail out on this game, but and I haven't actually that much. <laughs> But, yeah, no, that's, that's that right there. It's probably giving it away, but I really am not. Mania might be upgrading your characters and weapons and winning a lot of battles. But then I think Vice could be the same thing as Vicious. So maybe winning a lot. I'm not too sure. However, there is one that some people think that actually this is based on what your how you progress through the story 
and I'm not too sure that that could be it either. I think that progressing through the story, maybe, I can't really think of too many times when, like, you have to make a decision in the story. I know, like, there's a one part with Lars where, like, you have, like, this in-battle, in-story 2D segment going on, but, like, it's pretty much impossible to lose it, so I can't really think of too many points where the story might end up coming into a factor as this microtransactions of being a whale. But again, let me know what yours are looking at and what you might have done to make that happen in the comment section below. Again, there's a lot of discussion to be about this in specific, and I can't wait to hear what you guys have to say in the comment sections below. So yeah, let me know what your thoughts are, where you stand with this. If you have all of them maxed out, let me know in the comment sections below. Here's mine. Maybe because I bought a few tra microtransactions before this video, that might be because my greed is all the way up here. But yeah, if, if you liked the video or somehow found value from the content, be sure to like the video, subscribe for more near reincarnation content, and never miss a video by hitting the bell so you're the first to see when the video comes out. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. If you want, share this with your friends in the Discord, get them over here, let them go and talk it out too. But yeah, I love you guys so much. Stay safe and sayonara.